Watson. No, how? ngon vậy xếp một à
Ay, 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 so maybe I... Ay, sang quá vậy, so maybe I... Thank <laughs> you. 
We're ready, Gov. We're ready, Gov. We're ready, Gov. I don't open the door to strangers. I don't open the door to strangers. Someone close the door. I should find a way to attract the attention of Jeremiah's mother. We're ready, Gov. Little rascal! Refrain from anger and forsake wrath. Fret not yourself, it tends only to evil. Thank you, Father. You are so kind. Those brats are always causing trouble. Now, where are my manners? Uh, may I offer you a cup of tea as a small thank you? I don't know if... Uh, God bless you, sister. My name is Margaret Thorne. It is an honour that God sent you to me. You appear grieved, sister. Is it because of those children? Oh, no. It is my son, Jeremiah. I fear that he is doing bad things, Father. How bad? I don't know. He has just become nervous and angry and rude. And he used to be such a nice boy. These days he won't spend any time at all with us. Not even with Janet, his younger sister. He hides himself away inside his room and locks the door. And he won't open it for anyone. And where is your son? I don't know where he is. He hasn't come back from last night. I'm so worried. Perhaps his absence is connected with his job. Where does he work? I don't know if he has a job, Father. I've asked him several times, but he just gets angry and won't speak. Perhaps Jeremiah is being poorly influenced by his friends. I wouldn't know. He never mentions any friends. I am afraid that he could be possessed by the devil himself. He's changed so drastically lately. He won't tell me anything and he flies into rages and shouts at me. I don't know what to do. Don't distress yourself, sister. You were right to confess. Truly, I, I can feel an evil presence in this apartment. Oh, God! Allow me to search for the demon in this house. God bless you, Father. Case and books. Bookcase and books. Possessed wood and words. Book 
case and books. Possess the wooden word. Expel your literary demons. Bookcase and books. Possessed wooden word. Expel your literary demons. Ah! Wooden door. Iron handle. Battle the demon! Ah! Unholy vandal! Oh, Father, please help us! Oh, Holy Spirit! Save your pans from demons and poor ah! musicianship! Father, it's a demon! Fire and flames! Better for crumpets than foul-toothed demons! Be gone and bring peace! <laughs> Father, it's a demon! Father, it's a demon! Window! Window frame! I uh, must protect you! From demonic pain, pain. Sister, you saw that the demon has taken shelter in Jeremiah's room. I should go there alone. God save us. Sister, wait for me outside. This fight will be a fierce one. God help us. I'll do what you say. He planned to escape from London. A schematic for a homemade bomb. This is probably Janet, Jeremiah's sister. One of the solenoids for creating a bomb. This is evidence enough to put Jeremiah behind bars. It looks as though this letter was torn up in rage. I should reassemble the fragments to read what was written.
It appears that Jeremiah received a threatening letter from somebody known as the Dart. The Dart. He was at the center of a notorious case from 1888. It's over. The demon is defeated. Oh, thank you. Bless you, Father. Now, pray for Jeremiah's soul and give thanks, sister. Goodbye. Lord be praised. Goodbye. I have finished him. You know my methods, Watson. You know my methods, Watson. The game is afoot. Not a word. Into your clothes and come. Here it is.
Here it is. I am the last and highest court of appeal in detection. <laughs> it's a good thing that I came to help you at the tavern, Holmes. Actually, I... They will find the thief. Good day, Constable. Is Inspector Lestrade here? Inspector Lestrade is back at his office. Mr. Holmes, you're still alive. I can tell that that displeases you. Oh, a faulty deduction for once. Lestrade, I have two suspects in our case, Jack Cole and Percy Fleming. Can you apprehend them? All right, Mr. Holmes, I'll give the order to the constables. Inspector, we have both suspects apprehended. There you are. They're all yours. No need to thank me. Please, escort this suspect for interrogation. So, Jack the Hammer Cole, we meet again. <sighs> why am I here? Don't pretend that you don't know. You're a suspect in the case of an attempt made on my life. Rubbish. Just like the old days, eh? Arresting me on suspicion. You've got nothing. Oh, no. How about the revenge for the trouble that I brought to your gang? And also your brother. Don't you dare mention my brother. Your brother was hurt. It was a regrettable accident. He was in the wrong place at the wrong time. I can hardly be blamed for that. What? You bastard. You're the one responsible for him becoming a cripple. He was innocent. An accident, you say? Oh, I can't wait for the moment that you get whacked proper. Quad Erat Demonstrum. <laughs> That's your proof. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already.
you know what happened at Baker Street that night? I do know, but I had nothing to do with it. And where were you at the time? I was at my tavern all night long. I see. I went to your place and I saw a man with a hair lip arriving to meet with you. What business do you have with him? Business? He's a regular customer, that's all. And what about the suitcase that your regular customer brought to you? What? What are you talking about? Why, the suitcase full of stolen silverware that I found in your secret room? What? How? You search my room! It's not stolen! I often buy a lot of different things and sell them on after! It's all legal. Oh. Oh, I believe you. <laughs> Please, escort this suspect for interrogation. A good day to you, Percy the Dart Fleming. Huh. It's the flopper. Flopper? You're aware of what happened to Baker Street the other night. I'd say I'm a little luckier than that. Well, I don't give a fig. What were you doing two nights ago, around 1 a.m.? I was at the White Swan. The White Swan? The brothel that you own? That can't be counted as an alibi. What do I need an alibi for? Does the name Jeremiah ring any bells with you? It's the first time I've heard it. How about this threatening letter that bears your name? Oh, I remember now. A threat? Come on. Just a reminder for him to pay his debts. It's just a small one, and it's a matter of principle. How do you know him? Ah, oh, he's always coming around, begging for odd jobs. But he just talks rubbish. He's off his head. Do you have any business with Jack the Hammer Cole? I have. He sometimes provides my business with goals. But he's stupid. A hot-headed clown. Yeah. I'd be worried about him if I were you. Yes? He told me what you did to his brother, and... <laughs> well, let's just say he hates you. Personalized thugger. Hey. 
expensive cigarettes. It looks like encrypted records. Well, that's rather tasteless. Well, that's rather... Actually, I would far rather you stop helping me. Hmm, the text is encrypted. If it's Caesar's shift code, it might be easily deciphered. Elementary. It's a notebook filled with debts. And Jeremiah's name is on the list. to the cab, quickly! Follow that cab!
I should find a way to get inside. Something moved. I heard something. I heard there. You Something new.
Something moved. I heard. I heard something. That was nothing. I heard something. I heard something. An ancient Indian ritual knife, to me. I think I'll... It's closed. There was a fight here. Orson attempted to resist, but someone or something convinced him otherwise.
Oh, my cousin's out fighting bobbies and stealing antiques, and what do I do? Guard duty. Relax, Mike. You've got to earn it first. How long will that take? Two years already, and nothing's changed. I know, mate, but one of these days, I'm sure the boss will notice us. Shut tight. This shape matches part of the uniform of the Greek sentiment. I highly doubt that it's authentic. Something moved. There you are. Something moved. Something moved. I heard something. Something moved. The sound of a gong will attract the guards. I need to be careful. Boys, check out that sail. There's someone there. We need to get out of here.
Lestrade, I'm glad you're here. What's happened, Mr. Holmes? We've come from the abandoned St. Patrick's Abbey. I uncovered a gang of armed bandits there who did their best to kill me. Again? I'll send our best team to arrest them. Well, I doubt that you'll find anyone left, but if you hurry up, you might just find the spoils left over from their burglaries. I see. And I'd be very grateful if you could keep an eye on Mr. Wilde here. But Holmes! Spintria, used in the brothels of ancient Rome. How can I help you, Mr. Holmes?
Mr. Cole, I find you guilty of the attempt made on my life. What? I didn't have anything to do with it. It's all clear to me. You wish to avenge your brother who was left crippled by a stray bullet. That's just your sick imagination. Jack Cole, you are a menace to society and I have no doubt that you'll get an appropriate sentence. You Scotland Yard dogs! Constable, take him back to the cells. <laughs> 